spot right here. <laughs> Got it. Be good, she money dude. Bolts right here. The pipe's gonna go from here to here to here and then straight down that way. Right underneath those this. white guys. Yeah, so we're uh, part of the um, group called the Indigenous Pipeline Council. Uh -huh. and have you heard about line three? Yeah. yeah so the cheapest way is to run it straight through. Um, so actually this golf course here, I don't even know this, this is on contested Indian lands. Here? Yeah, here. Really? So that's what we're gonna, we're trying to uh, have access to this pipe that we're gonna have come right through. We're a native owned and operated uh, pipeline company. And uh, you can look us up. I love that head. Right. Cool, well, yeah, I'll take it. And uh, Carl, Carl Ironize. Carl Ironize. We've been granted yeah, the last uh, 19 miles of the pipeline to to, to, to uh, and through Duluth. But unfortunately, not all of this golf course, but some of this golf course is going to have to be in the way of the pipe. They might put it back down. They're looking at schematics right now. It might be an above ground pipe because that's yeah, obviously right the cheapest. There. Right through. Yeah. 